It's no secret, I love home organization, and I just find it so satisfying and rewarding to find creative ways of keeping my home and life in order. So today, I thought it would be fun to share with you some of my home organization favorites. These are the things that I come back to time and time again to help me organize my space. And I'm excited to share each one of these storage solutions with you, so if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, and let's get right into this. And as we get started, I just want to clarify these aren't really in any particular order, I just kind of wrote them down and went with it. But then jumping right into this, my first favorite are these glass jars with bamboo lids from Amazon. And personally, I just love the visual simplicity of this storage solution. In the past, it always drove me a bit crazy to have herbs and spices and all of these different shapes and sizes of containers. And I always found it difficult to keep organized because things just didn't fit together well. And so when I discovered these glass jars, I immediately knew that this was something that was going to work and work well for me. I love how easy the lids are to replace and remove, and it still creates an airtight seal. And so I really have fallen in love with these jars. They just make it easier to find exactly what I'm looking for and to kind of maintain order in both my pantry and I actually use them to organize my tea now too. But I have to say these jars really did just absolutely transform my spice area from something where it was always difficult to find what I needed and it always caused me a bit of stress looking at it to now it's visually just one of the most beautifully organized parts of my house now. And it's something that I actually enjoy finding and reaching for the spices that I need when cooking. So literally a night and day difference. Okay, and the next step is the super affordable label maker. I checked before starting filming and this thing is literally going for $10 on Amazon right now, which makes it by far one of the most affordable label making options out there. And I think it's great because you don't have to mess with any technology to use it. It's one of those kind of like old fashioned things that just works. All you have to do is move the letters to the appropriate position, punch them in, and you're good to go. So I love just how easy this thing makes creating labels, and the ones that it makes have this really cool kind of vintage-y effect to them that I think is fun. And in case you run into this issue like I have, I do quickly want to mention one of the problems that this label maker can sometimes have. Occasionally, it doesn't happen all that often, but sometimes the teeth that actually cuts the label can get misaligned. And when that happens, not only will it not cut properly, but the letters won't come out looking right either. But fortunately, there's a super easy solution to this. All you need to do is realign the teeth and it should start working again as normal. For just $10 though, this really is one of the most affordable and effective tools for home organization. I use this thing in so many places. But the next step, we have these tiered shelves. And I really do love how these just make everything easier to see and to reach. And especially if you're like me and a bit on the shorter side, these are invaluable. But regardless of what height you might be, they really do help you to take advantage of the space of deeper shelves. It's like stadium seating. It makes it easier for them to see you and you to see them. And what's so cool about these two is that they are incredibly versatile. Personally, I love using this one for organizing my tea, but you can also use it for storing spices, cosmetics, medicines, supplements, and anything else that could just benefit from some vertical organization. And there are a lot of different versions of these available. Personally, I love this one because I think the wood grain is so beautiful, and I've actually got it taped at the back here so that it stays in place, but it also expands too, so you can literally get double the length to fit whatever size cabinet you might have. Okay, and then four is another one of those just incredibly useful pieces, and that's a turntable. And this really is another great way to make your everyday essentials just a bit more accessible. So personally, I find them most useful in my pantry, but they can also be great for storing things like hair products or cleaning supplies, and you can really use your imagination with these. And these really just make cabinet storage so much more convenient, because instead of having to like reach in and try to like weed your way through products to grab exactly what you need, you can just spin it and immediately get exactly what you're looking for. So these really are quite the game changer, and what I specifically love about these ones too is they have a kind of a grippy lining on them, so it's really easy to clean out. Out, but also it makes it so that as you're moving the turntable around, your products aren't going to be jangling around and they'll stay in place. Okay, and then I know this one doesn't look pretty, but museum putty is absolutely a game changer for organization. If you've ever been frustrated by bins or boxes or basically any of the containers that you use to create a semblance of organization in your drawers, just moving around whenever you open and close the drawer, you need this. This honestly made such a big difference for me. All that you need to do is roll up a little ball of the putty and then place it underneath the bin that you're trying to keep in place. Hold it there with gentle pressure for 10 to 15 seconds and then you're good to go. 
And then when you start opening and closing your drawers again, nothing's going to move around and it will all stay in place. So this is another one of those products that I just use everywhere. My bathroom, our kitchen, the office, literally any time that I have drawers that I'm trying to organize, I'll use these to make sure that my organizational elements stay in place. And then this pot and pan organizer rack is another favorite. In the past, storing different pots and pans always felt really difficult and kind of clunky to me. Like there was no right way of storing them. I would just pile them up, cross my fingers, and hope that none of them would get damaged. And then whenever I needed one, have to like wade through the pots and pans that I had, tried to get exactly what I needed. And so these organizers really did have a tremendous impact by storing things horizontally rather than vertically, it makes it so that there's kind of breathing room between each and each individual item is easier to get out and it creates this seamless sense of order. And one thing I did to help make sure that this was going to stay in place in our cabinets was I just put a small command strip on each side of it and then secured the other to the bottom of the cabinet. And that way it stays in place as I get the various pans and drying racks out that I need. So this thing really is so helpful and there are a lot of great alternatives like this one for storing your pots and pans too. But for us, we actually use the bakeware set from Caraway, and that actually has its own little organization system built in. It's a very similar concept, but it's actually magnetic, so it's super useful, we love that. But just so you know, there are other alternatives like that for pots and pans, they really do help a lot. And then this next one is a quick one, and that's just a hair dryer holder. And I know this one is super specific, but can I just say, oh, wow, it is absolutely incredible the difference that this makes. Before, Christopher was always just kind of leaving his hair dryer out on the counter or kind of in a jumbled mess in the cabinet. And it always drove me a bit crazy, but there really wasn't anywhere good to put it. But it's been really cool to see because ever since we got the hair dryer holder about a year ago, Christopher has been really good about putting away his hair dryer in the specific designated spot. And it's great too because it just fits perfectly on the inside of our cabinet. And so tangled mess of cords, no more. This is really one of those solutions that I would recommend to anyone with a hair dryer. It's so easy to use too. It's made by the same people who do command strips. And so literally all you have to do is take off a quick piece of paper, apply it to the back of your cabinet, and again, and you're good to go. But then another one of those just essential organization solutions to me is drawer dividers. And these are just such a useful tool in helping us to create order from the chaos that is often our drawers. And there are a lot of options out there, but personally, I've always been drawn to the bamboo ones. First, from an aesthetic standpoint, they actually match with the interior of most drawers. And so they actually just visually kind of seamlessly blend in. But then also too, I love the quality of bamboo and they always just feel a bit more sturdy and built to last for me than other options. But I love drawer organizers either like this, where it's an individual box where you can group a large number of like items together, or even larger, more expandable ones for things like cutlery or other kitchen essentials. There is so much you can do with these and I feel like no home organization essentials video of mine would be complete without mentioning these because there's literally just so much you can do with them. Then another really versatile storage solution that's been growing a lot on me lately is cube storage. And what I think is so great about cube storage is it's really a solution that you can customize to fit your specific needs. You can pick how many cubes you need. There are a lot of different configuration options. And you can also decide if you want to leave the cubes empty and just kind of directly fill them with things or to use bins to even further organize them. And my husband is actually an artist, so we use these recently recently to help him kind of organize all of his art supplies. But I also love that you can use these for anything from kids toys to bathroom or kitchen storage to using it as a bookshelf and the list goes on. But probably my favorite part is that it's really easy to adapt these to really be able to fit your personal style. If you haven't been able to tell already, I'm really drawn to organization solutions that not only are incredibly functional, but that are aesthetic too. And so I love that with the cube storage, you have the option to use wood or rattan or some kind of woven bin. And it's something that you can really customize to suit aesthetically what you find attractive. And so I think it's so cool that they really make it easy to meet your needs, both for form and function. And then next we have command hooks. And I love that these make it so that you can easily kind of hang things up wherever you need to without actually having to drill any holes in your wall. And so they're great for renters or people like me who just try to put as few holes as possible into their home. So a couple of my favorite ways to use these are I use them to hang up bags in my entryway closet. That way they're not on the floor or just kind of honestly they were just going a little bit everywhere before I started using these. And I've also used kind of a similar version to hang up the squeegee in our bathroom. 
And those are just two ways that I personally like to use them, but I've also seen some great ideas out there where people have used them to hang up their oven mitts, a dog leash, their keys, and again, there are so many incredible ideas out there. And then from an aesthetic standpoint, this is another one of my favorites, and that's woven storage bins. A good bin or set of bins really can have a huge impact when you're organizing your space. It's just an easy way to group like items together. And personally, I am obsessed with these hyacinth ones. I think that they're beautiful. And I love that they come in a variety of sizes. I've used them throughout our pantry and realistically our home, and I just find them to be really versatile. But whether you choose to opt for something like this, or I have a cane rattan bin, that's another one of my favorites. I really do think that woven bins like this really fit the bill that I was describing earlier of things that are both beautiful and practical. Okay, then we're getting to the home stretch here. When it comes to organizing your closet, one of the products that for me has made the absolute biggest difference in our closets are these hanging set of drawers. And whether you're looking for ways to reclaim space in a small closet, or you just don't have room for a set of drawers, these really can be a great option. Both Christopher and I use these to help organize our clothing. And they're just a very easy and practical option. And then for organizing drawers, these bamboo drawer dividers really can be a great option. Especially if like us, you might have wider drawers in your kitchen, these can be a great way to break up that large space into smaller, more distinct areas. It's an easy way of being able to kind of create a drawer within a drawer to create distinct areas so that everything isn't just a jumbled mess and it can stay organized. And I will say another great use for these two is if you've used bamboo or some other type of drawer divider, but they don't quite fit the dimensions of your drawer, you can use these to kind of help wedge everything in place and just to create a long, thin space on the side that kind of acts like another one of these. I've done that in both our utility drawer and our cooking utensils drawer, and it really helps. Okay, then we've got just two left here. Next, let's talk about rope bins. And I love these as a great alternative to more traditional structured baskets. I find them to be especially perfect for any type of textile, a cloth material, because they're not going to snag on anything. That and the fact that they're flexible, there's kind of built-in movement to them, makes them an amazing solution for specific situations. I know a lot of people with kids love using them to store toys in because there's no hard edges for kids to hurt themselves on. And then one way I've been using them literally for years is to store my undergarments. It keeps them all organized and in one place, and it's just easy. So I've been using those undergarments baskets literally for years, but then more recently too, I've gone back to these rope baskets as a great option for kind of grab and go situations. I recently invested in a few of these for our entryway closet as a way to store some of our winter and kind of outdoor essentials, as well as sports equipment. It's nice because these have handles too, so I can just lift up the basket, grab what I need, and then put it back. All right, then last but not least are these gold label clips. And let me just start off by saying I'm not on board team let's label everything, but I definitely do think that they have their place. And with these clips in particular, I love that it's kind of a way of making labeling a bit more aesthetic and they're great too because they're very durable and you can tell they're just made to be quality. And what's great about that is that as our needs adapt and evolve over time, I know that they're still going to last, but also it's really easy to swap out the labels too. So if I know that you need one for traveling, I know I can replace it with something else. So I love that these aren't just like a single use, one and done type of purchase, but it's something that I can take with me through the years and I can adapt and evolve with me. All right, well, that's it. Those are 15 of my favorite home organization solutions, my must haves, if you will. And my hope is really that you might be able to use some of these to create a sense of order in your own space. Because I know at least for me, when my home is organized, it helps me to feel more at peace and at home in my own home. So that's just my heart in all of this, but as always, I'll leave all of the links to everything that I mentioned in the description box for you. So if you're wondering where something was from, just check there first. But now I want to know, what are some of your favorite home organization solutions and products? Be sure to let me know in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to give this video a like to let me know that you enjoyed it and subscribe if you haven't already for more simple and intentional living videos coming at you twice a week. And until next time, friends, I hope you have an amazing day.